It's one of the poorest nations on earth, yet Somalia is leading the way with mobile money. Whether it's to pay for a new shirt or a cup of coffee, about a third of adults are using their phone to do it. I use this service in my daily life in paying bills, for shopping, for taxi and for public transportations and other things. Mobile money transfers work on the United States dollar system, so it's a natural transition for Somalis who have long been using the dollar. Many Somalis receive their wage in dollars and remittances are often sent by mobile phone. Somali shillings only come in 1,000 shilling bills, which are worth about 4 US cents. No other denominations are available and their value continues to plummet, leaving Somalis little choice but to use alternative currencies. Our currency has suffered several bouts of inflation. Somali shilling inflation is very high. It's even hyperinflation. So the Somali currency cannot be stored anymore, and that has forced the people to use other currencies that can enable transactions at any time, such as the US dollar or the euro. But out of adversity has come innovation. Zad, a mobile money platform inspired by Kenya's M-Pesa service, has boomed since its launch in 2009. And those that don't use Zad have developed their own electronic payment systems. We introduced the EVC Plus service for customers to recharge their mobiles with airtime. People wanted to use this service as a platform for transactions. It has become very popular, even though it's not full mobile money transfer. Officials warn that reliance on the dollar will push up inflation and degrade the Somali shilling. But after over two decades of conflict, Somalis have taken matters into their own hands, bypassing the banks with a simple mobile phone.